Jesus, though, he has a way of hearing the questions that we don't ask. And he has a way of challenging the assumptions that we hold very dear. I'll put it this way. A savior without the power to challenge is a savior without the power to save. A savior without the power to challenge is a savior without the power to save. So Jesus begins to challenge the assumption of this guy who thinks he really knows what... See, the problem with love is that we think we know what it is. And we think that we've actually loved people correctly. I mean, there's books written about this idea. For example, the five love languages. It's a way to help us understand that the way we receive love is different from the way someone else receives love. What is love to you may be different from what is love to someone else. 